Hi, this is Jolene again from the facepaintingforumshop.com and I'm here to show you another quick design. This is one of my line busting designs and if I ever do it at a party, I have to do it over and over and over again. It's my tried and true rainbow kitty and I'm using Color Rush. Okay, and as we had talked about before, all the neon cakes need to be loaded at least twice in order to get a nice bright load and as you see here I've got a nice bright load across my forehead I decided to go more with the green I flipped the sponge and used the pointy part to get the ears and I remembered right about here that I should have put the white on first usually I apply the white that you see I'm doing right here usually I'll apply it first and then come back with the color but since I forgot I'm going to apply it second Now you'll want to make sure you use a soft white to go over the eyes. I usually use a paradise white mixed with a little bit of the shimmer white in order to get a nice soft white. That way it's comfortable over the eyes and it gives a nice soft blend. There you can see how well it blends with that on the end. So now I am covering my cheeks. And usually, right about here, I would uh, do the glitter. As it does not photograph well, I'm going to leave that out. That is Majestic Magenta I'm using. I'm going to use it for outlining. And this color is gorgeous. It's great for outlining and for line work. It's a nice opaque pink. As you can see here, I'm using a big fat number five, and I do a series of teardrops that are curved to simulate a little tuft of hair here, and then thick to thin lines for the ears. I like to also use a thick to thin line and enclose the eyes. Usually that's my classic eye shape for my cat, and then I'll take three teardrops in the corner to fill in the space. I will most of the time connect the forehead and then I'm flicking in on the sides in order to give a nice furry look. And notice all my flicks are down coming in a semicircle around the cheeks, go up around my mouth and around the smile line and then give it a little flick to the outside on both sides. Okay, the next thing you want to do is go right beside the nostril and start your nose. And go underneath. Do not forget to do the underneath of the nose. If you do, sometimes it can look bad when the person's going around and um, maybe the kid tilts their head up for a picture. You'll take a nice thin line and widen it out at the bottom. Flick, flick, flick on each side. And then I take a series of dots. Odd sizes going towards the center of my forehead. And then some right there on the center of my forehead going down towards my nose. And don't forget the ears, the inside of the ears, and flick several times. And that's it. This is a super fast line busting design, very colorful. Thank you for watching. Everybody loves this. Like, comment, and subscribe.